Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I will be reviewing Team of the Season so far, Wilfred Zaha. Um, we have got him for 148k. He has five star skill moves, which will be really nice with him um, with the scoop turns around the corner, especially because of his 97 pace. And the three star weak foot isn't is a bit like a bit of a sticky one, isn't the best, but I'm sure it, like it's it's still okay. We can still deal with it. His pace looks very nice. Um, acceleration bit lacking since that is more important than sprint speed, but still it's fine at this stage of the game. And 99 sprint speed is really good, especially when trying to just accelerate sprint past those defenders when you're side by side them. Shooting looks decent. 95 attacking positioning. He'll be making the right runs and when he makes those runs with the 97 pace, he's basically full on goal. 99 finishing and 98 shot power. He'll finish basically anything and the shot power just like he'll rifle it past the keeper easily because those two are probably the most important shooting stats. 91 long shots. Again, like because of his five star skill moves, if you're like a skiller, you'd like doing, I don't know, El Tornados or stuff like that. That'll be good, I guess. And volleys and penalties are really low, but they're a bit irrelevant. Passing looks like okay, not the best. Um, Vision 89 is um, fine, and be able to play those through balls. Um, over the top three balls and like be able to switch the play if he needs to. Um, crossing at 92 is quite good, um, and it, but if you like, it's not really that usable in this game. Crossing, I'd stay away from crossing. And 60 free kick accuracy is pretty poor, but it doesn't like free kick accuracy is a bit irrelevant if you have like. A player in your team that has like over 90, he'll be able to score. Um, short passing 88 is um, isn't superb, but like it's still usable. So he'll be able to do those um, really quick one twos and things. Um, long passing 76. If you are switching the play, he will be able to do it, but uh, he'll be I don't know a bit inconsistent. And 67 curve isn't the best when it comes down to like, I don't know, finesse shots and things like that. Dribbling looks really nice, again, same as the pace. 99 agility and 90 balance, like, the agility is like, just so good in this game. Um, and that you need agility to be usable as, a, as an attacker. And he's obviously got that, so... He'll be able to um, be. He'll be really responsive. Be able to quickly turn out of tight situations. And with a 90 balance, again, he'll be able to like just hold off defenders, stay on his feet. Reactions at 90. Um, again, comes in with the attacking positioning. He'll be a good poacher, and um, if he senses there's a run on, he, he'll make it. 99 ball control and 99 dribbling is really good for like the left stick dribbling. He'll keep it really close to his feet and the defenders won't have much of a chance. And with the 90 composure in front of goal, it'll feel really nice. Stamina, well, moving on to the physicals. Um, 86 stamina isn't the greatest, but um, uh, I think at this stage of the game, you all have like good, like, um, people on the bench, good subs that you can bring on for him if you need to. Um, like, But if you're using him at striker, I think he should last most of the game. 89 strength and 87 aggression is really good, especially because of his pace. If you're trying to do like a fake shot around the corner, he'll, he'll be able to just like get, he, like 
I find that he, people with high strength and like high pace, they when they're doing the fake shot around the corner, they get their body in front of the defender so they don't get bodied and it's really good um, with that pace. And traits, flair, isn't anything special. Um, now I'll head into the games where we review him. The post, man! What the heck? We are back after playing four games with him. We have scored seven goals and it is now time to review him. Um, the high-low work rates um, were really nice, especially if you're playing him as a striker. He won't drop too deep and he'll always be in the right position. Five-star skill moves, like this guy was rapid. So when you're doing those flip-flaps and uh, fake shot, no, um, scoop turns around the corner, who just accelerate past the defenders really easily. And the freestyle weak foot, um, I think I took one shot with his left foot and he like smashed it top bin. So felt more of like a four to be honest. So that was really nice. Pace, 10 out of 10. I don't know what it is about this card. Like he's quicker than, I don't know, like Adama, most 99 pace players. Like that acceleration felt like 99, so the spin speed didn't lie, but the acceleration felt way more. Um, shooting, 9 out of 10. He finished most things, but every now and again he would, like, I don't know, miss or hit it at the keeper. That, that, so maybe a 9.5, to be honest. But the attacking positioning was really nice, as I thought, with like the runs in behind. The 99 finishing was really good went through on goal added with that composure so he could like really easily place it past the keeper 
and with the 98 shot power, with the near post angles, he could just um, easily get it into the goal before the keeper could reach it. Um, the 91 long shots, I didn't use too much. I think I probably used it like once or twice, and it was good, nothing special. And penalties and volleys, I didn't use. Passing, 8 out of 10. Um, vision was quite nice, but nothing too special. Um, yeah, and with the crossing, I didn't use or nor the free kick accuracy. Short passing at 88. Like, short passing doesn't even need to be that high because it's really simple to just do one twos. Um, long passing, I probably used like once or twice, and it didn't, nothing too special, but again, it wasn't terrible, so that's fine. And the curve 67 wasn't the greatest with the finesse shots, but I don't think it mattered too much. Dribbling, um, 10 out of 10. Like, because this guy, he could accelerate so fast, but he t and when he sprinted, he took really big touches. But like, sometimes those players, when they like dribbling, they don't keep it that close to his feet. But this guy was like really good. Um, like agility was like so good, um, and the balance was really good. Especially like you don't have to have too much balance in this game, so he kept. Um, is really strong um, quite easily. Reactions 90 were really good when um, making those runs in behind and the ball control and dribbling at 99. As I said, the left stick dribbling, like the quick touches for the heel to heel was really good. Um, the composure 90 in front of goal, he was really composed. On for the physicals, um, I'll probably give him eight and a half out of 10. The stamina, wasn't the best but like it wasn't it's still usable and it's like august i'm sure you guys have plenty of super subs who are like just as good as zaha um and the strength and aggression was probably one of the best things about this card because like normally attackers who have that high strength and aggression they're normally like quite slow or like quite clunky but this guy he had so much pace, he was really good on the ball and the strength and aggression was really nice. So if a defender was trying to body him, he could just hold him off quite easily. And if he was doing again, as I was saying before, those um, fake shots around the corner, he used his body to get in front of the defender. Overall, I'll give him a nine out of 10 and value for coins, uh, nine out of 10, just because like 150K, you could probably get like some objectives that are as good, maybe not better, but as good as this card. Um, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy and I will see you in the next video.